Klaus. Yeah. So the issue, the sub that you said, it's really good, but I can't run a full tank of fuel because the weight causes the front end to be too low, and I can't drive the car. <laughs> okay, then just uh, just lift. Just, yeah. just raise the front a little bit, but don't change the spring. Only raise it a little bit in the front. Well, that's why I, I, if I wanted to do a full tank of fuel, I would have to raise the front to 13 rather than 12. Oh, no. um, but why, able... why do you want to uh, go on a fuel tank? Because well, I'm saying you... if I want to, if I want to do a no-stop raise, then I would have to raise the front. But I'm not going to do that anyway because I don't think the tires are going to be good for a no-stopper. Yeah, but you also have to change the tires anyway, don't you? No, it's not mandatory. Ah, you okay. must get away with the tires. I think it's more damage if you're worried about. You can get away with the tires if you're careful, but I can't run mediums either. Like I said, class, I can't run mediums because if I if I try to lower the PSI, then that also uh, lowers the front end, and I can't yeah. drive the car. So yeah, I'm just gonna that's, keep that's it. What we found for the <laughs> I'm just gonna keep it where it's at and just when there's a VSC, just pick because I don't see there not being a VSC. Okay, that fix my force feedback issue. So. Job. I now have to learn track and qualify. But I mean, I've raced this before, so it should be that bad. Okay, you know, so second to last qualifying time. Okay, this one, oh my, yeah, Draven's gonna win this round. Why? Oh, did you know? Oh, DPI. Uh, yeah, he's just set a 13 Oi, yeah, that's serious business. My check.